Welcome back to the forest and yes guys it's been a while and I know a lot of you have been asking for it and I'm actually going to be testing this out in creative mode the brand new update 0 0.63 we're going to go through all the brand new stuff and then you guys are going to get a common fields and tell me whether or not you want to see a series of this again do you want to see I have over I don't know 800 videos if not more of this uh, game and I've done so much and if you guys want to go back and check it out I know most of you have uh, yes, uh, I've done way, way, way more than I ever expected, and I love this game. So this is actually my first love. This is the reason why I started YouTube. I got uh, this game, and I got into PC gaming right away. And I was on uh, GTA first, but afterwards I jumped into this game, and I fell in love with it. So survival. So this game actually brought me into uh, YouTube survival, and I ever since then I haven't looked back, and I'm very thankful to it. Now we're going to look at a brand new update. We're bloody as hell, but that's fine. Uh, we just crashed, and this is creative mode again, guys. I do not like creative mode. I will not build heavily in creative mode, but I will test out things, and things like this where I can't, because I don't have a build or anything done. I want to test it out, but these are actually the things I really want to test out, these uh, zip lines. So I actually ran to this side of the mountain just to, well, the, the actual area here, just to test this out. I want to try this out. And, ouch, all right. Let's see how much it would take to to build all this. I'm curious. Uh, there we go. Yeah, keep on sticking around this way. We want to go as far as we possibly can. Bring it out there, buddy. Bring it out. I don't care. Bring it out. I want to see how far we can go. Is this still? Yeah, it's still. We still could do it. All right. Can we zip line all the way across? That is as far as it goes. I think it's a water. Actually, it's just a reason. But we could probably bring it right to another side but this is good we're actually gonna press e here and how much would that take to build 20 rope and 10 logs it's not bad at all i could do that easily that is a really long zip line i can't wait to test it out there's a whole bunch of brand new stuff here uh, they've added a slew of them including a brand new flashlight and a, well the new look for the flashlight which i'm very curious and uh, this game is absolutely awesome also the ghost as you can see if you actually press the escape button here and go to options, you actually go to gameplay, and you have the actual ghost you want. You can change your colors if you want to, to purple, green. Uh, you can change your, this actually will start off very low, so I'd recommend you to bring this up high to see what you're building. I kind of like the blue one. Uh, we can actually go through them all if you guys want to see what it looks like, each and every one of these. So this is actually, let's say, uh, this one. This is the blue one. And let's try out green, let's, or actually, let's try out this color. That's cool. Ooh, actually, that does stand out quite a bit. I didn't see that. All right, let's 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 test out the other green one. Because the other one is just a regular color. Back to that horrible one. And we're going to go back here. So I can't believe they actually did it finally. They gave us, they listened. Oh, wow, the green is really sweet. Surprising with the green on green. I thought it wouldn't show up. Ooh, I might like the green one best. Oh, it really pops. Yeah, I like that. More than the blue does, I find. Maybe up here won't. I don't know. We'll have to test it out and see. All right, well, we'll get to this build afterwards. We'll test out the crane. But first, we're testing out the zip line. Let's jump on this baby. Woo. <laughs> All right, that is freaking awesome. Woo. What is he using? His axe. Is it his axe? Yes. Oh, shit. I just want to see what he used. All right, guys, I'm going to pause the video. We're going to do that again this time. I'm not going to look up. I want to feel the whole way down. I'll be right back. All right, back up the hill, and we got to do this again. All right, this time we're looking straight forward. I'm not looking up. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, I love the sound, too. Oh, <laughs> baby, that's hot. Oh, the zip line is really good. I was surprised. I heard people saying we're going to put zip lines, and I was like, mm, not too sure. Uh, there is actually another zip line too you can actually do from tree to tree. We're going to test that out. And we're actually going to open up and see there. Tree to tree. Tree zip line. All right, let's see what this is. It must be cheaper, I guess, on logs to build. Rope should stay pretty much the same. Uh, let's. I wish I could go higher on this, but I think I'm going to have problems with obstructions. Because uh, we have to be able to hop on it. So that's not going to work. Let's see if this would work. If this is going to let me... Ah! <laughs> All right. Okay. Let me let me go back up here. Thank you. And we're sliding back down. Oh, Jesus. 
All right, right here, and we'll press rotate. It should bring it up here. There we go, it's perfect. I should be able to grab onto that and bring this out to this tree, hopefully. It's not letting me do it. It really would be low in it. Oh, it did let me. Okay, well, what does it cost to build this? Does it show me? It doesn't show me. I don't think it let me build that, did it? Oh, because I'm here. Perfect. Let's uh, let's try out this uh, tree sublime. Let's see what it looks like. All right, let's let's jump up. Can I grab this? Oh, I can. Just jump up and do it. Oh, sweet. All right, that that's pretty cool. Can I can find some things to do. I wonder how that would work in smaller areas. But that's that's not bad. That's not bad at all. All right, uh, we are gonna have to go and get to the light. I'm also gonna have to build myself a base somewhere on flat land. There's some flat land down there. Let's 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 have an excuse to take the zip line again. Oh my god, this is so much fun. Campbells would be so confused. You can jump off of it. I was curious, can I jump off and slice the sons of bitches? You can. Sweet. All right, this seems like a very big area for us to build. All right, let's test this out here. We're gonna have to build up a quickly a small building. I probably have to do it off camera because I won't bore you guys with it because it's creative mode and if you're wondering how you get to creative mode you have to finish a game so once you finish the game you'll actually get creative mode plus uh, some extra multiplayer costumes i guess you can say or whatever uh, i think it's tuxedos you get for finishing the game uh, different clothes and all that so it's pretty cool we don't need anything really snazzy here just need something that can build upwards and get through here we go and this so this is the hardest part pretty much making a shitty platform which probably, you know, looks like crap and it's badly placed, but it's okay. I'm actually picking up rocks. Wow, creative mode. Creative mode building is brought to you by bullshit. Now, it's fun for for this portion of it, guys. Uh, if you look at it, this is just fun and testing out. I don't like it for when people lie that they actually built things, but that is fine. That is fine. We're going to do our best to enjoy this. But I'll never build like this. Uh, I prefer to do my work and pick up my logs and do all the work. I'm going to make the actual stairs going up on the side, guys. The reason why I'm going to do that is because hella, the cuts and everything else can be real pain in the ass to do. So we're actually going to make just the stairways like this here on the side of it. We're going to actually make it look nicer than that round. It's actually pretty good at the green. I like the green we attach it. So here we go. It's fine just a little bit on the inside oh that bird just scared the shit out of me all right we're actually going to build up a top part here a ceiling cut some floors that's just ridiculous oh creative mode all right and then we're gonna have to do another wall here because the reason why i would do this for the crane we have to test it out properly the only way for us to do it is to build it upwards I had to build at least another floor for it to attach to, right? I mean, it makes no sense to have this, and I just locked myself in. <laughs> hey, you gotta love it when I lock myself in. Yes, Game Edge, you just locked yourself in. You're such a rookie. 800 times, and you locked yourself in again. All right. It's okay. That's no, fine. That's no, fine. All right. We'll put this here, and we'll make a custom floor on top of this. Now, like I said, it's not going to be pretty. This isn't meant to be pretty, pretty. This is meant to be a workable. And for us to test out the actual base and stuff, uh, we're going to make another... There we go. Stairs over here. Making our way down to this. Ugh, so difficult to do properly and to match out. Now, without a little bit of, you know, messing around. And I'm just messing around right now just to make it work. It's not going to be, again, functional, really. It's going to be mostly just bearable, as you'd say. Very bearable. There we go. It actually goes right on top of each other like that, really? That's very odd. I never thought of doing that. That worked out not bad. If I lowered that just a bit, that would have been pretty good. All right, let's just do it one more time. Another 
ceiling here, another wall. Let's see here. Um, bump, bump, bump. Let's see. Custom walls. And here we'll make a door. Press R twice, and we got ourselves a doorway. And uh, we can actually make windows if we want to here. Let's press R, little window here. And uh, whatever, little window here and here. Where? Let's get up. Just add some light to here so it's not so dark. It's insane to build. Now you actually know how, if you're wondering how some people build and they don't tell you guys they're doing, uh, they're making those massive builds. Just they do this and then they pretend that it's actually real. They actually can turn on the mutants not if they tell you because there's no modes. They allow us enemies in creative mode now. You can actually turn them on so they can pretend also. So just in case, not be fooled. It, it is a thing. You can actually do that. Uh, yes, so let's build our crane next to it. Again, I'm not looking for it to be perfect. I just want it to show up. Now, I'm worried about how this is going to get onto the side of this thing. How is that going to happen? Anyways, we'll see. It'll be the first time. Everything's a, a trial basis here. All right, what do I do? I just rotate. Oh, boy. Uh, tell me that it goes flatter than that. Okay, you really have to find a, a flatter area or something that's not going to get its way. Holy shit. Stop freaking out. Okay, let's rotate this. Is there a good way or a bad way? I don't think there's any good way or bad way of doing this. All right. And you click what? And you, oh, you bring it up. Okay. So you click up and you bring it up and then you press E. All right, well, at least the elevator starts at the bottom, a crane. Move yourself upwards. It didn't bring me to the top floor, really? Because there's no walls. So you really need a wall or something or an opening from each side of these to make this work properly. All right, I, I, I understand a little better now. I guess it's the first time I built it, so I'm not too sure. What if I hugged it onto it? Uh, let's try that one more time without it freaking out, please. All right, yeah, let's do it like flat like that. That's good. Yes. Oh, it's going to destroy that. It's telling us right now that there's collision issues. All right, let's do this again here. I really do like that. Oh, that looks like it's perfect. Might just chop it out. Oh, my God. Yeah, I chopped it up. And uh, the elevator won't work. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Let's let's take it apart. So we're changing the way we build things. Definitely a must to practice here. I wouldn't want to do this with regular logs and being pissed off after I wasted a whole bunch. Uh, let's get her out of here. Out of touching the actual base itself just enough just to say it's kissing it there we go like that and can I get up to the top top floor I can okay there we go that just went up higher oh no no I don't want you oh well, I guess you are gonna circle yourself oh don't go around don't destroy anything else okay let's do that one more time and we're gonna bring it uh, sure All right, so it will work because it's right there on the ground. Okay, now the biggest question is, will this allow us to bring the logs into it? Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Can't get back up there? There's no way of bringing this back down, is there? I don't think there's a way for us to bring this back down if we're stuck, so we definitely would have to have a second step or something. Let's see. Let's test it out with this one. That's good enough. No, there's no way to call it back down or to drag it back down with a pulley rope. I think they're better off putting that in, not in the middle, changing the way the pulley is. Anyways, we're going to try out to see whether or not we can bring in a... Bring in a log sled. That's what I really want to know. Please tell me we can do that. Please, 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 please. 
That's the whole point of this, right? Pretty much. Well, one of them would be to drag this on. Okay, let's let's do it from forward. Okay, no, that's not gonna work. Oh no, this is some kind of collision thing. It won't let you in here. Hmm. As soon as I get it, it drags me back out. Okay, let's. Can I trick it? Or they make sure to nerf this. No, it's it's not able to do it. Okay, uh, how about building things on here? Maybe log holder? Yeah, we can. We can build a log holder. That's good. That's not so bad. Alright, we, we can do that. That's, that's really good. And I wonder if we can fill this up. Can we? I don't even know how they fill up. I see guys fill these things up completely with uh, fake log or logs themselves and I don't know how they do it <laughs> don't know how they do it okay so you can actually build that all right guys I got to pause the video here I'll let the, the night go and we'll have some sleep actually we'll build a bed let's wake up right away let's screw this I got too much to do here to waste our time with this uh, where are the beds again the shelter have to put a bed in here I'm pretty sure there it is all right Let's get a bed in here. We'll sleep the night away. We'll press Z. I can't sleep, really. They're not going to let me sleep. Ugh. All right, guys. Well, we'll wait it out. I'll be right back. Actually, I'll go and pick up the katana piece. The one piece. Where, well, not katana, but the actual flashlight for the katana, which is right up here. If you guys are ever curious, go and check it out. In some, a lot of my videos, it's the same place where you'll find a lantern and a lot. The lamp. Or just stick around and watch this part. We're also going to go back and build a whole bunch of goodies. While we're waiting for sleep, why not do this portion and check out the new land, uh, the new light, which is supposed to be changing everything. I'm looking for two rocks over there. There it is. And this is it. This is the one I want. Don't fall down. Oh, it does make a difference if you fall down. Let's let go. No fall damage. Oh, my stomach just turned inside out. Again, we're in creative mode, so you can do whatever the heck you want without any damage. Uh, where is the rope? There it is. It seems a lot darker than usual. Now, there isn't any mutants or anything in here. No cannibals. So you won't have Armsy, which is usually to your right-hand side. You have Armsy and stuff over there. And over here, we actually is where we're going to go and pick up the lantern and see what how bright it is. Now, the previous light, the torch itself, wasn't very good. I, I didn't like it. The flashlight seemed to be very, very weak. And I'm curious to see whether or not they did something different. Now they supposedly brought up to a military grade or a combat grade, I think it is, uh, flashlight, which is like a mag light, I guess, like the police officers use. And, well, I just got lost. It's easy to get lost. All right, there you go. It is really dark. The light is barely visible here. All right, well, that's good. We have that. Let's see if we can actually, there is a new look. The plastic torch. All right, batteries are 100%. Holy shit, that's bright. Okay, that's much better. I wish we can adjust the beam and stuff. Be cool if we can do that. We can't. The katana is still here. It should have been here still. That's strange. Usually the katana is always here. Huh. Did it get kicked around or something? Oh, there's a fuel for the chainsaw if we were needed. Did I pick it up? I did not pick it up. Wow. All right, the katana is not here. It's supposed to be right here. This is the location and must be a glitch or something. Maybe creative mode, you don't get it. I am not sure why that's not showing up. We'll actually light this baby up here really quick. Let's see if that's true. Did they change the location? Or is this just a glitch? I would have to test it out again on another save, but I just went the last time. I didn't see any notes about them changing that. And you can pick up everything over here flares some supper if you're hungry no i'm not seeing it anywhere always yes always if you're coming back down here katana is usually right here right beside this guy it is what it is i'm not sure what happened we're gonna go back up and get some sleep and i'll meet you guys up upstairs this is actually really amazing this light god it looks awesome all right so the torch outside is 
beautiful too. It is absolutely stunning. And I'm telling you right now, this is the cat's meow. I'm going to pick it up. The only thing that's the downside of this is that it needs to be refilled constantly. So that is going to be an issue. We're going to sleep for the night. And daylight will come. And we'll be able to build while the light is still extremely bright in here. It is gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I am really happy we can build all those goodies on here too. Uh, you can build a bench if you want to. Can we? Or is that going to stick to the ground? I'm curious. Is that going to stick on the ground? Can I bring this up? Oop. No, that sticks to the ground. All right, well, that's that's a flaw. But at least this thing here, we can fill it up. That is a really nice. We'll turn off the lantern. We won't need that anymore. The light. And, oh, man, I love that zip line. we got to do it one more time. Did that bird. Oh. Actually, you know what? Let's, let's go and show you guys something. Then we else we have to do. Then we're gonna come back and furnish this up and show you guys all the brand new furniture. Now, if you guys remember many, many seasons, I started getting bored. I think around season 15, uh, something like that. And I started building furniture that wasn't there really. I just built what I can build with. Caught on quite well. A lot of YouTubers took it and ran with it. And yes, it, it worked out extremely well. It looked very, very nice. And unfortunately, uh, yeah, it's they finally well, unfortunately, sorry, they after all this time they actually started making furniture. Which is really, really sweet. There's a lot of things we have to go through. All right, let's go back out here. Let's do the new birdhouse. So now the birdhouse itself will give you feathers. So you do is you build it, put it on a tree, just like you would a birdhouse. Put it down here, let's say, for now. There we go. And hopefully the bird itself will show up and do their stuff. And then you'll be able to come here just like your sap, your tree sap. I think it was a tree sap holder we used to use. And this thing here, the sap collector. And you can actually put this against trees too. And bam, this will give you sap overall. So you have sap and then you have your bird feathers, which makes it really nice for arrows. Excellent idea, isn't it? I think it's a really cool idea. Um, all right, let's 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 do this. Can't help myself. Oh my god. Oh, man. If that was a way, I'd be taking a bath every two seconds here. I'd be jumping in and down. All right, let's get over here. And we're going to make our way into the second floor, I think. Sure, this, this looks as good as it gets. Uh, yeah, it has a little bit of lighting. All right. It is very, very small, but we'll test it out. Plus, we'll have the actual rat, this thing here, which is pretty darn nice. All right, um, let's get this going. Let's see what else we can build here. Yeah, this is a lot more secluded on there. Let's bring this up. Up you go. Let's test this out. I mean, we gotta test it out, right? Okay, how do I get out of this again? Press E, right? Okay, that's pretty even. It's nice. I didn't fall through with gaps. I guess we built it properly. You'd have no problems with it. That looked really cool. All right, let's. Go. I just was curious, guys. I'm, I'm beyond curious when there's brand new things like this. Uh, all right, zip lines and stuff. We've done it. Of course, this is all the old stuff they brought in there. Tables and chairs, which is really sweet. And here's the fireplace, which remember I used to build a long time ago. Uh, it looks like they brought a fireplace in. And this looks like the right side, isn't it? We'll find out very shortly. Yeah, I used to build this and then they nerfed out some issue where they didn't like me placing the, bolt, the actual fire into these things. So anyways, yeah, I caused some issues and errors when I used to build. But now it looks like they brought it back. Well, they actually built themselves their own fireplace. And pretty much close to what I used to build. So, yeah. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I'll accept it. As long as you can fit these ones in. The rocks. Because it kind of looks on the side. Let's see here. Alright. Now in creative mode, I don't think I need to add any kind of... It won't give me the option to make this brighter and stuff. No. It's not letting me do it. Yeah. Well, it's okay. Uh, they actually have a mantle here, which is really sweet, really beautiful. Uh, we're actually going to be trying out the new... Where are you guys? The new couch. Let's see what that looks like here. Rotate this baby up. It's falling through. Um, let's rotate here. Beautiful. A couch. Uh, let's see what else we can do. We're gonna get a little, da, 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 da. Oh, a bone chair. Gotta see that. Sweet. Oh, we can actually sit nicely in it, too. 
I, I'm... Was I sitting in it or just popped me out? As soon as I started looking around, okay. As soon as I started moving, it popped me out. That's nice. Same thing for the couch. You can sit down in it and chill out. That's perfect, just like our bench, I guess, as he took the bench and made that work. All right. And now we have the piece de resistance, which I can't wait to try out too, is the bone chandelier. All right, that is, again, they used to make these things about a log higher or something like that, and I think about two logs higher would be perfect for height. Wise, when you're building, I would really love to see them change this up uh, big time. It, it changed from one update to another, and now I gotta do two of these, two of these walls upwards to make it look somewhat nice, because uh, chandelier is too, way too close now. That looks beautiful. It just feels odd. It really does. It's okay. We'll leave that be. And there's also a side table which you can build. I haven't done that yet. I wanted to see what that looks like. A little side table, a little coffee table. Nice. Very cute. All right, I'm I'm liking that. Did the fires go out? No, they didn't. That's pretty. All right, let's see if we can actually. There's still no car real carpets, is there? All right, a stick frame. So I guess you can put his pictures into it if you want to. I'm talking about the Tommy's pictures and stuff. A little stick frame, or we actually have a bone frame. Over here. And I guess you can put one on a mantle if you want to. I should grab one of these and just put it right here if you want to, but it's still... I wish you'd find a way to make that look better. That's not horrible. It, it looks okay. All right, so we got the fire going. We got everything else running. We have this. That looks pretty darn nice, I have to say. I'm kind of very, very impressed right now. Roger. <laughs> this is actually used for multiplayer. If you want to talk to people, you have to have this to get close. Unless you're in, of course, team chats or something like that. It is plenty fine. Wow, this is absolutely stunning, guys. I'm loving this update just for the look of it. We also have the garden to check out, too. But uh, this is very, very nice. Yep. Yeah. I'm liking a lot. All right. Um, I don't know why I didn't use that. I want to see it without the damn axe. All right. That's beautiful. Let's uh, check out one more thing here at the new garden. Man, I get so flustered when I see new things. I want to test it all out. It's too much. This one is actually a really good update because it is pretty massive. How big of... All right, so we'll, we'll see what we're talking about here. From what I read, it looks like we can actually expand the way we actually use a garden here. So I'm curious to see this. Hope it works as well as they make it sound like it's going to. Uh, of course, I have to find the damn thing. There it is. Garden. It says, says small garden. Okay. Oh, that doesn't look like it's a big one. Well, oh, yeah, it does expand. You just walk like a picture in your... On Photoshop and you're expanding it. Very nice. How far can we go? Even if it's through the rocks, it doesn't bother me. I just want to see. That is pretty massive. So we can actually make a large plot to actually... Yes. To actually make our garden. Wow, that is really nice. Much better than a small little blueberry uh, gardens a lot. We can actually fill up quite a bit more here. I'm liking that a whole lot. All right, guys. I think we've done a really good job. We've gone to see everything there is. I don't think there's anything left to see in this book. We've done, well, the new drawing racks and stuff we saw it last time. I don't see anything else that's brand new on here. And I didn't see anything else in the notes. But if I miss something, I will make sure to mark it and we'll see it next time. Again, if you guys want to see next time, please hit that like button. Tell me, Game Edge, I want to see a season of this. I want to see it back. Maybe we'll get a couple episodes a week. It'd be great. I will try my best for sure. So thank you so much for being here. Really do appreciate it. This is the Edge for Game Edge. And I'll catch you guys on the flip side.